the succulent flower pot. There are three green yarns in the kit in water green, willow green, and dark green, corresponding to crochet the small, medium, and large leaves, the succulent small leaves. Working into a magic ring, wrap the corresponding yarn around your fingers like this. Insert hook into a ring on middle finger and pull up a loop. A match crane is formed. In round one, work one chain stitch, six single crochets, and one slip stitch. Work a chain stitch first. That's one chain stitch. Next, work six single crochets. One single crochet is down. Place a marker in the first stitch through the underneath of both loops of the V-shape. Continue to work 5 more single crochets. Six single crochets are down. Pull the yarn tail tight to close the ring. Remove the marker. Finally, work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 1 is down. In round 2, start with 1 chain stitch, then work a set of 1 single crochet 1 increase for 3 times. Finally, end with 1 slip stitch. Work 1 chain stitch first. The first set, work 1 single crochet and 1 increase. Work 1 single crochet in the first stitch. Place a marker in the first stitch. Next, work one increase, which means working two single crochets in the same stitch. One single crochet and one increase are finished. One set is done. Keep working two more sets. We work one single crochet and one increase as one set. After one single crochet, work one increase in the next stitch. The second set is down. Now the last set, work one single crochet first. Next, work one increase. Three sets are down. Remove the marker. Finally, work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 2 is down. In round 3, start with one chain stitch, then work a set of two single crochets, one increase for three times. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. The first set, work two single crochets and one increase. One single crochet is down. Place a marker in the first stitch. Work one more single crochet. Two single crochets are down. Next, work one increase, which means working two single crochets in the same stitch. Two single crochets and one increase are finished. One set is down. Keep working two more sets. We work two single crochets and one increase as one set. After two single crochets, 
work plan increase in the next stage. The second set is done. Now the last set, work two single crochets first. Next, work one increase. Three sets are done. Remove the marker. Finally, work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 3 is down. In round 4, start with 1 chain stitch, then work a set of 3 single crochets, 1 increase for 3 times. Finally, end with 1 slip stitch. Work 1 chain stitch first. The first set, work 3 single crochets and 1 increase. 1 single crochet is down. Place a marker in the first stitch. Then work two more single crochets. Three single crochets are done. Then work one increase in the next stitch, which means working two single crochets in the same stitch. One set is down. Keep working two more sets. We work three single crochets and one increase as one set. After three single crochets, work one increase in the next stitch. The second set is down. Now the last set, work three single crochets first. Then work one increase in the next stitch. Three sets are done. Remove the marker. Finally, work one slip stitch in the first stitch. Round four is done. In round 5, start with 1 chain stitch, then work a set of 3 single crochets, 1 decrease for 3 times. Finally, end with 1 slip stitch. First, work 1 chain stitch. The first set, work 3 single crochets and 1 decrease. 1 single crochet is down. Place a marker in the first stitch. Then work two more single crochets. Three single crochets are done. Then work one decrease. Insert hook into the next stitch. Hook the yarn and pull up a loop through the stitch. There are two loops on the hook now. Insert hook into the next stitch. Hook the yarn and pull up a loop. There are three loops on the hook. Yarn round hook and pull through all three loops and hook. That's a decrease. Three single crochets and one decrease are finished. One set is done. Please finish the rest of two sets by yourself. Now three sets are done. Remove the marker. Work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 5 is down. In round 6, start with 1 chain stitch, then work a set of 2 single crochets 1 decrease for 3 times. Finally end with 1 slip stitch. First work 1 chain stitch. The first set, work 2 single crochets and 1 decrease. 1 single crochet is down. Place a marker in the first stitch. Then work one more single crochet. 
two single crochet sat down. Then work one decrease. We have demonstrated one set. Please finish the rest of two sets by yourself. Now three sets are done. Remove the marker. Finally, work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join in this round. Round six is done. In round seven, work one chain stitch, a set of one single crochet, one decrease for three times, and one slip stitch. First, work one chain stitch. The first set, work one single crochet and one decrease. One single crochet is down. Place a marker in the first stitch. Then, work one decrease. One single crochet and one decrease are finished. One set is down. Please finish the rest of two sets by yourself. Now three sets are down. Remove the marker. Work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join in this round. Round seven is down. Now stretch a loop and remove the hook. Now break yarn, leaving a long yarn tail. Pull the yarn tail out. Thread the yarn tail through the needle to sew hole closed. Then conceal the yarn tail inside the fabric. And finally, cut off the excess end. One succulent small leaf is completed. Please finish two more small leaves by yourself.